I'm talking of careers. That's yeah. what we want to talk about here in our morning conversation. I'm seeing so much going on on Twitter. Mm. It seems like all our dreams got derailed. <laughs> Nini? Ni. Haki. Mazi, I'm seeing people who had big dreams here. Well, go and talk, huh? Hey, hey, hey. People who wanted to be neurosurgeons. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> People wanted to be pilots. Now you lose the and the gangapi palace. See what you do, pilots. You know, dreams are very important, by the way. Let me just say that dreams are very, very important. Are you and if you've got a dream, it's never too late to pursue it because that is a hunger that's within you. So the question is. What happened? What happened to your dream? Have you thought about that? What happened to your dream? Me, and what me. did you want to be? Atasi Amin. Jacinta Mbothen said, I wanted to be a nurse. Eh? <laughs> Nazaza. <laughs> She's eh? an engineer. She's an engineer? Yes. Well in. What did you dream about? David Ogaro, a very, very good morning to you. Abel Kibeta Mekusalimia sana tena sana. Let's talk about your dreams. What happened to your dream? Me, it's obvious. Me, I went abroad. I saw Maisha in a bamba. Aki. Nika pig and duru. Eh. My dream died like that. Aki yao. Weka mikono juu. Shida Aki. chini. Eh. But then, you come and kusomea nini UK. On a serious Law. Note. You are going to study law. Yes. Huh? I was going to be a lawyer. Huh? Yes. Na ukakula school fees yote vili na faku. <laughs> but you know, mine. You are a gift to Aki Kenya. Aki yao, guy. Even how you tumbled to on radio. What would I do a village is better already? KK were Kirgit saying, I wanted to be a Catholic priest. Eh? Then what happened, KK? What happened? <laughs> yes, Charles and Zaro, yes, Bobby Wine tops the richest lit uh, free uh, artist in Africa. It's Bobby Wine. Mm. Bobby Wine. Thank you. So what happened to your dream? Ah. <laughs> the devil is alive. Melvin and Dati, I wanted to be an engineer, like in physics. <laughs> Melvin and Dati, we are a gym. Hey. But you see, you're a great admin now and a great content creator. Yeah, and that's where the money is. So what happened to your dream? Uh, Why aren't you living your dream? That's my question this morning. Anna, we were never guided. Hmm? Yeah. There, there were no opportunities. What happened to your dream? 0711-046-105 is my number. Hit me up on Twitter at Classic105 Kenya or at It's My Neck Again. Don't forget the hashtag is My Neck Why aren't you living your dream? What happened? Me, it's very simple. Mm. Me, I went and I messed up. Hands up. Big time. Big time. Yeah, you, what's your excuse? <laughs> yeah, with no apology. Me, I messed up. Sita <laughs> Danganyana. So, you, what's your excuse? Kakula school fiziote. Nambo. Me, I get a single room. You, Naishi, come back, Jana, and Moi, London. You, who not you? Hey, hey. Come, Rory, and you to Ambia. Simulu, and I, London. Yes. Naya, kind of shule. Yes. Na we will come on a canna to a fence. <laughs> ya university. See, at a cook, at a sick one, a co fence. Yeah, at a sick one, I end up. Ulishkana na watoto wa, wa, wa president. Yes. Huh? Man. Mukakula maisha na big it spoon. It was a sweet life. Thank you. I used to, my local. Yes, please, you don't mind. Was at the Hilton at Mayfair. Oh, wait. So the atrium had a balcony overlooking what? Buckingham Palace. Is that central London? Yes. Next to Downing Street? No, next to oh, overlooking Buckingham Palace. Oh, sorry. And oh, it's in the upper <laughs> Jew. Uh, River Thames? Um, uh, uh, oh, sorry. Uh, Eye of London? <laughs> sorry, sorry. Buckingham. Eye of London, you are juicy. Oh. Buckingham. Uh, <laughs> okay. Buckingham. Boja Baina. Ulikuwa kikunyo pombe ukiangalia Queen. Yeah, Buckingham Palace, yeah. Eh? Yeah? Eh? Yeah. Na unafa kwa college? Eh? Yeah? Eh? Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> Young guy. I swear the things I did. I swear the things I did. But what I like you, you, ac you accept. You, you accept have to. It. What do you do? The dream is over. Uh, the dream is over. The dream is over. 
Eh? You what is your excuse? I me I messed up. Oh seven one one zero four six one zero five is my number. You can hit me up on my fan page on Facebook as well. Why aren't you living your dream? Let's talk, huh? Yeah. You what you excuse you? Dream yangu likuwa kwa mzungu. You cannot have a dream like that when you're a child. Ha, eh. <laughs> I had because. Sini mimi huyu hapa. Mambo yangu kutoka hiyo wakati. Ah, that was your dream. Yes. <laughs> Na ni ni zai watoto tu point ndio mimi huyu hapa sasa. Uwi dio ba. Eh? Okay, so what was ah, your dream? Let's talk, eh? Yeah? Hello. Hello, Maina. Morning. Morning too. Eh? Uh-huh. Sasa mimi Maina yangu. Eh. Hey. Ilikuwa kwa rubani. Rubani pilot pilot yeah ni sivyo mambo na mandege eh yeah. lakini saa hii mimi na uzanga mayai ya kuku chukuko ni ndege <laughs> yenye kuku ni ndege so wewe bado ni rubani tu yeah. <laughs> why <laughs> I swear, I swear, Asante Zada. What is this now? <laughs> Hello, Classic 105. Maina, good morning. Good morning, my dear. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. You're well? I'm fine, thank you. Story of my life. Uh, I so badly wanted to be a news anchor. A news anchor? Ah. Yes, I grew up I, having my role models as Hamisi Temo and uh, Bad Musin, you know? Uh-huh. And then I grew, uh, I, I was like asking my mom, what, well, these people have been having, uh, must be having some big memory to bring that bulletin, to cram that bulletin for a whole 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> you thought they used I, to cram the whole bulletin? Yes, <laughs> yes, I was young. Uh, so I, I, I was like, now I need to grow my memory. So yeah. I, I, I joined the drama club. Uh-huh. Yeah. Wow. And did solo verses. Uh-huh. Yeah that I could cram for like seven minutes. I went further, even in high school, I did narrative. Uh, yeah. And uh, what a play, this plays for 45 minutes. I joined campus. Uh-huh. I pursued journalism. Uh-huh. I, uh, again, I, 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 I uh, just trying to maneuver my way into media. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Now came my time for attachment. Uh-huh. That is where I think it all. I I got it wrong. I didn't get a, a, a chance to be in the, uh, in a on the camera. Yeah. What I had, I went uh, for my attachment at the Ministry of Information. Uh-huh. The Ministry of Information is basically print media. Yeah. To cut a long story short, I am here instead of uh, having uh, that laptop or you know on the camera. I'm here in a parastato company <laughs> uh, carrying customer forms just around the office and i'm like father what went wrong oh no oh. can you imagine and i think that's not all up to date the the the, the, the fire I, I think i have something that tells me i just want to be a journalist sometimes i put heels and i wear uh, just a nice dress i go look myself in the mirror and then i just bring this uh try to anchor news like you know brenda obura there was yeah. that with you used to yeah uh, i just try thank you just like that just to see if they say but come on ile ile moto ilikuwa ndani yangu ya being a news anchor is it still there it's still there but no now you're in the parastato <laughs> yes <laughs> listen it's not too late yes you can actually I can organize a screen test for you uh-huh so why don't you inbox me on any of my social media platforms. Wow, that would be nice. Thank you. Okay. So we are talking yes. about dreams. You know, dreams are very important. Why aren't you living yours? Why? That's my question this morning. What is your story? Hello. Hello, Maina. Uh, good morning. Good morning to you. Hey, Jimmy here. Yeah. Now, I wanted to be a priest, my brother. You wanted to be a priest? I wanted to be a priest. Eh? Uh-huh. You know that song by Willy Paul, Mabinti wali ni changanya? Eh? Mabinti ndio wali kuchanganya? Ya, ikiliumara buwana. That dream went just like that, just like that, just like that. <laughs> so, so what do you do nowadays? Uh, presently, I'm a salesperson. Uh-huh. But I anticipate uh, that one day I'll join the radio. One day you'll join media? Yes. Well, you never know. You can. I like your voice, by the way. Ah, without a doubt. Thank you, sir. Okay, and I wish you all the best, huh? Thank you. <laughs> Hello, Classic 105. A very good morning, Maina. Morning. Sorry, me, uh, 
Kingani hapo. Ah, msalimika. Yes, my name for me I wanted to be a pilot. Eh? Uh-huh. But it was uh, extremely expensive to be a pilot. It is by the way. Okay. So, what my mom did, uh-huh. she told me uh, go and study uh, customer service. Yeah. So I did customer service. Eh. Uh-huh. And I ended up to be a cabin crew, close to a pilot. Wow. So I was a cabin crew for many years. Yeah. But ningekuwa nikiingia hapo pale kwa cockpit na angalia pilot na sema I wish ningekuwa kwa hiki kitu mmekalia. Yes. So and uh <coughs> excuse me. So uh, at this time, yeah. I just want to tell those young youths out there. Yeah. That being a, a pilot it's it's expensive yes. Yes. But si lazima uko umesoma sana. Yes. That's another secret I want to tell you everybody. Yeah. Yes. So as you guys young persons out there who are dreaming to be a pilot. Yeah. So many shuleni alafu and pray God kama mzazi yako anaka kitu awapeleke shule and at the same time yeah this age there is a certain age to be a pilot yeah so by the time i was a cabin crew i was around 24 yeah so when i got uh, good money now i can go to a pilot school yeah i was I passed 30 yeah so when you know, when you pass that you cannot do a pilot really so, uh, yes piloting in it's around i think maximum age is 28 wow kama sije sawa ukifika that yawezi hakuna shule itakuchukua they need a young mind wow someone, someone who can uh, <coughs> anaweza shika hizi vitu yes so at the young age at least from a, uh, 18 to 28 are you still a cabin crew member no i already finished i'm retired now okay yeah just but, retired during corona period but at least you lived close to your dream sindio so i've flown around i've seen things so i've i've just kind of an experience it I really okay. I I am so happy for you. Ebu in, mm. captain umefanya vizuri ukakuja. Kuna kitu mnasemaga kabla watu wa land. Sijawahi elewa mnasemaga aje. Nini hiyo kanga hii? Ile mkienda ku land. Sasa assume tuna land eh eh ama Mombasa. Sasa hiyo ni hiyo ni captain ana ana nonsigi like uh, 20,000 feet before before we touch down. Eh. That's ladies and gentlemen, please uh, fasten your seat belt. We have 10 minutes to arrive to our final destination like kitu kama hiyo anasema the weather and all that. Wow. Yes. Akia. But uh, being a cap- uh, captain uh, or a pilot yeah. it's a very uh, expensive thing. Fulfilling. Expensive and a luxurious job as well because they get paid heavily. And you but at least you've seen the world, isn't you? You have. I've seen the world, yes. Ah, I envy you. Thank you for yeah. sharing your story, yeah? Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Asante sana. Oh, alikuwa flight pass ama alikuwa. Yes, using the cabin crew. Yeah. He never quite became a pilot, but he still got to see the world. Mm. Wow. Eh? Why aren't you living your dream? Ah. Dreams are very important. Have the fine old bad, huh? Hello. Good morning, Mr. Mine. Good morning. My name is Kim. Yes, Kim. I want to contribute to, uh, to the conversation today. Karibu sana. Okay. Uh since I was a young boy, uh, I used to to dream of becoming a military man. Yeah. And that dream was very big. Yeah. Until uh, my teeth. <laughs> Until? Mena ilikata mena ilikata niingie huko. Meno ilikata aje? Yeah, so you go to the recruitment then una kwambia wewe meno meno hapana. Meno kwa nini? Kwa nini meno yako inakaanga aje? Yeah, sikungoa, kungoa ni kuna gaps nyingi kwa kwa mdomo. Ah, kiangai. So, so what is the what is the what must you have? What is the minimum when it comes to teeth? Uh, m- mostly when you go to the to the field. Uh. They check they check on uh, the the physical the your physicality first. Yeah. Uh, they will check your teeth, mikono. So wanaangalia wanaanga, wanaangalia meno ya nini? So ndoto yako ikakufa hivyo. So what do, what do you do right now? Ah, so I mean broke our sim up at town. Ah, kiangai. Ukitaka simu? Eh. Nita kupigia simu. Uko na namba sahihi. Haya sawa, asante. I I had a connection. Mm. Kiangai. With a friend that uh, he is at uh, he's in US. Eh. He's a marine. Uh-huh. Anytime I, I talk to him about the the line, 
the, the uh, connection mm. ilikuwa ni ile time ako mlevi ndiyo ata niwangalesha hizo vipi ya kiongai so now you can't you can't uh, nini rely on him hmm. ika sama ni sawa tu haki ni sawa by the way <laughs> yeah. ok thanks for, for sharing your story with me niki itaji simu nita kupigia Aka, a, sa, hata saa hii saa hii <laughs> aya sawa asante <laughs> asante